dying, but I'm not stupid. I'll call Gus. It's my wedding day. Even I'm not so unlucky to die on my wedding day. What's with this chain? This is monkey business. What are you on, park cleaning detail this week? No, not quite. Oh, Olivia has her own park now. Yeah, it's not what you think. I'm sure it's worse. No, she's dying. I mean, she... The woman needs a heart. She's really dying. Like Rick? Yeah, when we all found out, I, I just wanted to be there for her, you know? Just a little bit. Just be there for her? Just friends. Yeah, just friends. You just needed to save somebody. Just friends. You are just so you. <laughs> you can't help yourself. Poor Olivia. She's very lucky to have you. She asked me to marry her. What? I turned her down flat. <laughs> <laughs> but, uh... I don't know, I greeted the mayor, you know, and I, I thought getting a park named after her would let her know that everybody, everybody in town loved her. <laughs> that everybody loved her and she was the most special person in the world and that she actually made a difference. Yeah. I just, I know that because once upon a time, a certain guy made me feel that way. Of course, I never got a park. I, I, I never got a park. You want a party? <laughs> Someone's getting very heavy. Gus gives the best baby back ride. Oh, I'm glad you think so. I know he oh. does. Lord, now didn't you have something you wanted to show me? Some picture or something? Uh -huh. that, can you show it to me? Sure. I'm dying to see it. Where is it? Upstairs. Look at it. Thank you for coming to pick him up with me. You know, they missed... You. I missed him too. I gotta get going soon. Um, I gotta check on Olivia. Mind if I just. Hey, uh, yeah, and, right, thanks. You never stop, do you? I need the bread. Thank you. It's right there where it's always. I know it's that one. Never stop what? Rescuing people. Well, sometimes it costs me a little bit more than I care to lose. This is weird for me. What is? I don't know if I'm in a place yet where I can talk about you. Funny, it's coming from the woman who's got a boyfriend moving into the house that I built. Okay. <laughs> so do you have stronger feelings for Olivia than you do for Natalia? I don't know what I feel. I know that uh, I can give Natalia and Rafe, you know, a good home. And when it comes to Olivia, I, I just, I'm just trying to make her last days as comfortable as possible. But? Either one of those will never be us, you know? I gotta get going. Thank you. Gus, I read somewhere that most marriages fail because people believe that they have to be in love every single day. Is this advice you're giving me? Or is this something you're admitting? I was. Well, it wasn't just you. Are, are, is this, are we friends now? Is, that, uh, is this us being friends? I mean, is that what this is? <laughs> I wouldn't have it any other way. <laughs> okay. To throw some paint on these walls. I fired my handyman. You got yourself a thief. Get out! Where 
where's Gus? Um, he just left, sweetie. I wanted him to see my picture. Oh. It's gonna be all right. You don't know that for sure. Today could be the day. We have to stay positive. I'm really glad you're here. Olivia really needs you. Apparently she's not the only one. I'd be lost without Olivia. I don't want to be alone again. Shoot. I gotta go. What? I just have an appointment really quick, just upstairs. So call me okay. if there's anything. Go, I gotta cover. Okay. Hey. So what's the word, Doc? Well, I guess we need to have a conversation. You've been where I am, Rick. Don't lie to me. How much time? I did just speak to your doctor, and he told me you're at the top of the registry, but he can't make any promises. So the truth is, it's just a race against time right now. Richard. He saved my life. I hated that he had to die. I didn't, I didn't even know the man all that well and it's still hard for me to wrap my mind around it somebody who is almost a complete stranger is responsible for me being alive so who knows maybe that person's out there for you too hey can i get something for you yeah a new heart would be nice okay that's well, done and josh I need to see Josh Lewis. How is she? She's weak, but she's hanging on. And what about Ava? Uh, well, she's holding up, but I'm more worried about Emma. Emma? Alan, he's waiting. Of course he is. I've taken some steps to make sure that it doesn't get custody. Well, Olivia's very lucky to have you on their side. I'm sorry, this is so complicated. Well, the only complication is that little girl could end up without a mama. Uh, hey, hey, is everything all right? Uh, it's the same. You know what? I'm going to go grab us some coffees. Okay. Thanks. Thanks. What's up? I told myself I wouldn't be alone. And I promised Emma. I promised her that we would never be alone again. I'm lost. My appointment. I took a pregnancy test. I came back negative. I was so sure. I know it's not much, but you still have me. It's everything. I'm glad to see you. Well, that's nice to hear. Where else would I be? I don't think you can save me from this one. I don't think I've ever had to save you from anything. Oh, well, maybe a few times, but you had your hands full with Reva. Ooh, <laughs> score! A Reva shot! You See, know. maybe you're not as sick as you think you, you are. You left yourself wide open for that one. I'm losing. You know, at times like this, people start to question their faith. I start to question God. No. I have to tell Cassie how sorry I am for her. It's very hard being a minister's wife. <laughs> hmm. Feisty to the very end. <laughs> oh, the end, huh? It sounds like you don't have much faith either. This belonged to my mom, Miss Martha.